No, this I'm... is a very unique thing known as a trendy, overpriced Melbourne cafe. Let us walk you through some of the things that make it so special. Firstly, this is a door. It's kind of like a wall, but it has hinges. You should be writing this down. When a customer comes in, they'll stand by this sign. Whatever you do, do not seat them. Eventually, they will get bored and approach the counter, at which point whoever is there will say... Sit wherever. I, I do not care. Now, if a customer wants a takeaway coffee, ask if they have a reusable cup. And if they say no, look at them like they've just personally strangled a Galapagos tortoise. If they say yes, look at them like this is the hugest inconvenience imaginable. Like they're trying to stop you from strangling a Galapagos tortoise. Why aren't you writing this down? Now, Stephanie, well, let's talk merch, because apparently cafes need friggin' merch now. Take whatever you'd like. We'll just dock it from your pay. Look, Mark has milk. People seem to be off dairy these days. Maybe it's too much udder or too much tea. So that's why at Morning Brown we specialise in the milk of the platypus that secretes through its skin. Yeah. Teat free. I regret telling Mark this fact. Mm, platypussy. Yeah. Now, Stephanie, when you're on the floor, you're representing us, so we need you to wear our apron. Now, where's yours? Um, I... <laughs> Just kidding. Here it is. <laughs> we'll dock that from your pay. And never let me catch you without it again. <laughs> banter, banter, banter. Now, when a mother and daughter come in, you want to say... Gee, are you two sisters? Here we go. Gee, are you two sisters? <laughs> yeah, we are. What's wrong? I can't lie anymore. You're my daughter. I had you when I was 17 and... I was young So and mum's scared. my grandma? I'm so sorry. I always knew. I always knew. <laughs> this is the availability ledger. Just chuck your avails in by Wednesday at the latest, but we're pretty chill. If you do forget and you can't work, you are going to come in. I don't care if your sister's your mum or some shit. You are coming in. Hello. Some people think of this as just a job to get a bit of spending money, but it's not. This is a career, like a butter churner or a bush ranger. So you should think about what you want to do with the rest of your life. You can piss fart around in school with your Englishes and your maths and your sosas. Or you can be like us and join the incredible world of owning your own hospitality business in an overcrowded and extremely volatile market. So did you get all that? No. Seriously? None of it? No, that was too fast. So I'm guessing you just want me to just serve some customers? <laughs>